Yeah, hi. Good afternoon, everyone. This is Tanisha Singh from Integrity Migration Group. Today, we have a very special guest with us. We have Mr. Mithun Thakkar from iStick Business School, Paris. So, a very warm welcome to our page. I hope you are doing good. Yeah, I'm doing good. Thank you. Thank you, Tanisha, uh, for inviting me on your page. Okay, for a live session. Thank you so much. Yes. So today, we basically, I just want to recall to all my like viewers and the students and who have been watching us. This session is basically for all those students who want to have Schengen study visa, Europe study visa, and within their uh, budget framing, and uh, they do not have language barrier options like IELTS or PT. So we are going to just dissolve all those inquiries. So let's just start up with the introduction of the uh, I Street Business College. Okay. Uh, see, let me first give you, giving you my uh, my introduction. My name is Mithul Thakkar and I am a representative of South Asia for Aztec Business School, Aztec Business School of Paris. Okay. So Aztec Business School, this school is established in 1961, right? So this school is in 60 years and this school is native French business school and located at Paris, beautiful city, in heart of the city and in France, country is France. Okay. So uh, now any student going for uh, study out of India in, in anywhere, like in European country, it can be it can be from Western country, any country. OK, so first they will going to check their base. OK, so our base is very much strong as uh, we are since uh, 1961, 60 years old and native French business school. And uh, we are very well known for our uh, you know uh, business management and marketing program. Right. So I take business school. Uh, we are. Uh, our uh, school is believing in uh, believing in uh, more uh, practical knowledge so our course is designing like this so we are providing more uh, duration uh, into uh, internship okay so whenever any student uh, coming for the France for the uh, France okay uh, for the study okay so in France internship is mandatory okay here uh, to getting their degree certificate and uh, everyone is getting a, a paid internship and uh, there is a good amount of paid internship. So this is a very good opportunity for uh, the student to, uh, you know, uh, learn and earn. OK, so in uh, internship, they can uh, do full time, uh, full time kind of work. Right. So basically, uh, I would like to just uh, tell all those students, Jubi students basically France study visa ke liye apply karna chahte hain. So yaha pe Mr. Mitul ne baut ek important baat batai hai. That is, uh, when we talk about basically, kyunki bahut saare students ke mindset mein ye framing hoti hai ki government college and public university mein apply kar liye to humara refusal nahi aayega. But that is not the case. It entirely depends upon the how much the uh, the institution has been esteemed like prestigious and reputable so as uh, you said the institution itself has been established since 60 years so uh na kahin jo ek ek uh, refusals ki jo chances aate hain ya approval ke jo chances aate hain ya jo embassy jo hote hain to usme college kahan se kis background se bachcha aa raha hai kahan pe apply kar raha hai it matters a lot at the end so uh, yeah. That is the uh, we, we can say uh, college ke regarding kisi ko bhi uh, as a double mindset ya kahi pe bhi confusion hone zarurat nahi hai and the campus itself is situated in uh, Paris. Paris. So, right. uh, so uh, Paris me campus is there the most the hot city uh, as you said uh, mm -hmm. France and uh, related to programs what all options we can have and what all students having the background can apply and the admission requirements. Okay, uh, see in our school. For uh, as I told you, this is a native French business course. So we, as of now, we have bachelor program, but it's in French language. But in hundred percent English taught program, we have in MBA program. Okay, so our MBA program we are available. So in total five program we are providing. So one is MBA International Business Management. Second is MBA Corporate Finance. Third is uh, MBA Digital Marketing and E-Commerce. Okay, four is business MBA business engineer. Okay, and uh, five uh, five is MBA luxury management. This five program available same in eighteen months program, eighteen months MBA program and twelve months MBA program. So our MBA program is divided in two part. One is twelve months and eighteen months uh, program. Okay, so twelve month master program for those people only. Okay, who have already done their MBA degree and those who want to uh, do their second time master dual degree. Okay, so those uh, those profile are only eligible for 12 month master program and in this 12 month master program student will get six months of internship 
okay six months of internship they will get which is including course uh, in 12 months duration right and uh, the course fee is very reasonable in entire uh, you know france especially in paris especially in paris if i'm talking about our fees range that no one can provide you no one can provide you okay so the for 12 month master program fees range is 8880 euro only 8880 euro only and uh, 12 month master uh, for 12 month master program and now i'm coming to the point 18 month master program so 18 month master program for eligibility criteria we need any bachelor degree it can be from arts commerce science uh, engineering background any background we need bachelor degree with minimum of 50 percentage okay so those profile are eligible for 18 month master program right and for 18 month master program in 18 month master program they will get total eight month uh, internship which is including course okay so in 18 months there is eight month of uh, internship duration okay and the 18 month course fee is 12980 euro so please note here this 12980 euro this is not for one year course fee this is the entire 18 month course fee and this per fees range that no one again i tell you no one can provide uh, provide uh, any student to especially in uh, uh, especially in paris because in paris uh, uh, especially the mba fees range is started from uh, 14000 to 15000 euro per year so it will be going to course there like 30,000, 28,000 euro for entire MBA course. And we are only charging for entire MBA course for uh, 13, you can say 13,000 euro, 12,980 euro that I told you. And uh, now I'm coming to the point, any student planning, okay, for the study, uh, planning for study at uh, France. So in France, uh, there is a most important thing you need to check, RNCP certified program, okay. So RNCP is a French regulatory by government, okay. This is accreditation given by them, okay. So if course is RNCP certified, then student will get their post-study work opportunity, PSW, which is called, okay. So post-study work opportunity, then so our all course are RNCP certified, level seven accredited, okay. So no need to worry, all students will get their stay back after completing their study. Okay, so this is all this eligibility criteria and everything. So hope you are clear. Right, right, right. So basically, uh, students can easily, without having a second thought, can apply easily because the tuition fees is like highly affordable. Being uh, situated exactly. in Paris, yeah. Yes. Because uh, if if we compare with like uh, even though with uh, any other institutions or like on a, on a general scaling, the fees could be on a higher side, like eighteen thousand, three thousand. It could be even more than that. So your yeah, fees is like highly affordable, and uh, when, when we when we like talk about the like uh, living accommodation expenses, so so okay. because they have that mindset because Paris is like quite cost, costly and all that. So what will be the tentative expenses that a student can minimize actually? Okay, see in Paris, uh, in France, especially in Paris, uh, so it little bit uh, you know uh, get into more, but not as much let me explain you uh, uh, i think okay so there is a monthly expense is 850 euro so this 850 euro monthly expense is including your uh, rent uh, your utilities your transportation then your uh, <laughs> medical okay and everything so hardly your uh, you can see your uh, your grocery so his grocery you 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 will buy like uh, hardly 40 to 50 uh, 50 euro you will get for entire one month grocery right there is a room rent you will get like between uh, you know 250 to uh, 400 euro in between 252 to 400 euro and the one more most important thing here branch government providing for international student okay caf it is called CAF CAF housing subsidiary benefit. Okay, so this CAF housing subsidiary benefit for all international students. So here, student can uh, student will get uh, rent up to thirty percent of the rent refund from uh, French government side. And this is for all international students, not for like EU student they can avail. Okay, so this is for all inter. Again, I am telling you, uh, this is for all international students. So right. for an example, they are paying like three hundred or four hundred euro uh, room rent. Okay, so they will get up to thirty percent rent refund for government side so this is the benefit so there is a, a quite nominal compared to uh, other western country okay so this is affordable living cost okay especially in paris and uh, affordable uh, fee as well and one more thing here here in france you can apply with moi basis okay if you have moi then no need to give any english proficiency okay right 
so yeah but if you if you don't have a, a mode of induction data in that case uh, we need is to fill or pt so is right. myp is also acceptable and affordable fees and affordable living cost as well and cap housing subsidiary benefit as i told you this is for all international students right so this is like one of the most uh, we can say the salient feature because most of the students have the like uh, barriers related to lts or pp or something yeah. or they have their like, low score bands so simply yeah. on the basis of medium of instruction in english board english medium yeah. basis they can easily apply yeah. and uh, um, if that students have that mindset that uh, that, like if we talk about the Schengen study visa or, France, yeah. or any European country, they have that mindset that at the end they will be getting a higher rate of refusal because of the uh, embassies interviews and all that. So can you just share okay. some some sort of tips because they have this mindset mm -hmm. if you talk about that in other India, but but this is not the case. The questions will be putting up only related to the SOP, the confidence level. Mm -hmm. Why? Mm -hmm. Okay. See, uh, about refusal, we can't say anything. Okay, visa is not on our end. But uh, if uh, uh, if your uh, you know if you avoid refusal, so you must be clear when you apply. Okay, so when you apply, so you must be clear about your program. So why you choose? Uh, why you first? Why you choose this country? For an example, you choose France. Okay, so why you choose France? Why you want to go France? Okay, so there are numerous benefits to study in France. So you can say that. Second thing, uh, why you choose this course? Whatever the course, for an example, you have chosen this uh, MBA International Business Management. So why you choose this course and how this course will going to helpful in your career? Okay, and what is your career goal? Okay, basic uh, future career goal. Okay, and uh, is it this program choosing this program uh, will going to help you in, in, in into your uh, future career goal? Okay, so just just connect your future goal or future career goal, uh, uh, future career goal to uh, your you know current uh, current stream is current whatever the study you will going to for an example I told you MBA international business management. So then modules uh, modules will be. Covering uh, like uh, trade financing, okay, international logistics and everything. So you might be going to uh, start your business. So definitely, it will be going to helpful in your uh, in your business. Well. Okay, and uh, uh, those people, those students who are uh, uh, you know uh, planning to study, uh, sorry, planning uh, planning uh, to work with MNC. Okay, so they will also get very good opportunity after completing this study. So right. you need to be very clear right. about your thought. You need to be very clear about your, you know, future uh, future goal and uh, your perspective about your, uh, you know, uh, study. So this is very normal. No need to worry about uh, during this uh, interview, embassy interview, because this is very nominal, very normal, normal. They just asking just about yourself and uh, what is your goal and anything of nominal question. They no need to worry about, no need to nervous on. So this is the basic things you need to be uh, taking care. So basically, uh, it's a, like a bunch of opportunities, and we can say so many uh, advantageous features related whether to the like admission eligibility criteria is quite smooth. Then oh. we have uh, the tuition fees itself is so much highly affordable, exactly. and and the, regarding the interviews, we at Integrity Immigration Group will be helping out all our students mm -hmm. entire the process Great. related to. Uh, in interview and and one more thing if we talk about the interview process so uh from institution end there will be a round of interview which the students can easily just pass it they still they mm -hmm. need not to again get frightened and all that so what mm -hmm. would be that interview basically can you just uh, give a quick uh like briefing okay from institute uh they will take uh, taking the interview of the applicant so they will also going to ask them basic question okay or tell me about yourself what is your uh, uh, their, like about their academic background if they have done their bachelor degree in commerce so about their academic background if they have any work experience okay there and again that why why they choose uh, this course okay why they choose france why they choose uh, our school for any like, they are coming for a business school okay why they choose a business school only nominal four to five questions that's it okay we will check their uh, english proficiency level that's it. Uh, there is a very no normal, uh, so no need to worry about the. Uh, Just you know, like so. uh, basically related to their like introduction, a kind of self introduction, introduction and confidence mm -hmm. and English speaking skills. Right? Yeah. 
okay so now the like quite important concern part from students and is that how will be they get in the like assistance into the uh, like part time work or how how are the like opportunities will they be getting the part time work assistance related to their field and once they are done with their academics or like mba program how how the opportunities will be like opening up their the doors what would be done okay so see uh, every uh, any international student Uh, can do part time work uh, in france there is a 20 hours per week they can do part time work first thing second thing uh, as i told you we are uh, uh, providing more duration uh, uh, for internship what uh, in internship you know, what we are providing no one can provide so why we are providing a student can earn because here in internship they no need to go to school okay therefore the class here is the internship it means full time uh, kind of full time of work okay so here in internship they can earn well okay and uh, uh, technically if you see uh, they are on student visa during their internship so if they got for an example they are uh, uh, doing their internship uh, 10 am to 4 pm okay so if they are getting some little bit time so they can uh, do their part time work as well as i told you that 20 hour per week so they can add it uh, uh, those hour as well so yes there is earning opportunity as well and after completing uh, their uh, program mba program so student here student can uh, uh, can do participate at our campus okay uh, there is a campus activity so in campus activity our partners company uh, come uh, along with their requirement okay in every academic year so sometime they are taking uh, on the spot interview sometime they are taking their uh, cv okay and uh, uh, their uh, you know Yes, uh, check their CV and uh, call them for the interview at their office. Okay, so it depends. But yeah, every end of academic year uh, at our campus, uh, this uh, uh, job dating activity is going on. So yes, they have uh, multiple or uh, you know uh, opportunities with them. Right, because as we speak about the programs which you mentioned in the earlier, so these are the most demanding programs which is France is like quite known for. <laughs> so. so most of the students are seeking so again i would like to just clear all to the like students that uh, still if they have any kind of doubt of confusion in their mind still they can easily reach out to us and there are like many students who are still just pursuing their like uh, plus 2 or they are, they are in the final year of bachelor and all that so they can still start up the process on the conditional basis instead of waiting for their results Yes, uh, if they are see uh, currently October twenty four intake is going on. Okay, so uh, if they will get uh, you know their uh, degree certificate, uh, degree certificate or provision certificate. Okay, if it's okay if they are getting online uh, mark sheet. Okay, so uh, within a two or three months, right? So they can apply during the time period. So you can just send uh, send on case to case basis. Okay, send it to us. So I will guide you. in that this case what will go to but just first they need to check with their uh, university when they will get right and like uh, all all the students don't think that we have so much pretty much of time the intake is october but this is not the case it's a process mm-hmm. which is going yes. to be take approximately 2 to 3 months a process is yes. taken so yes. this is the right time this is the ideally time don't just waste your time instead of just creating the gap in terms yes, of academic knowledge just start exactly. the process exactly. so So apart from all these USPs and the Syrian features which we have just discussed, anything else you just wanted to add up regarding the study visa for? Okay, that? see, uh, let me tell you one thing. When you uh, going for the France, okay, especially in Paris, Paris is a tourist place. Okay. And uh, Paris has a very rich culture. Okay, so uh, France has a rich culture. So you will going to uh, you know experience that rich culture as well. And especially our school, as I told you, there is a native French business school. So we have a ratio of seventy thirty. So thirty percent of international student and seventy percent of uh, local French students. So at our school, uh, you will get uh, good French culture. Okay, right and. Uh, Yes, uh, Paris is the most uh, beautiful, and now it's uh, coming to the fourth most popular uh, country. Uh, so, uh, France is the fourth most popular country, on the, and Paris, uh, the place is the fourth most popular destination for the international student. 
okay and uh, yeah you will get sanitation visa and uh, one more thing uh, the benefit of uh, internship if you get uh, internship from other other part of european uh, other european part okay for an example you will get uh, internship from netherland or any uh, germany or any 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 part of europe european part so you can do internship from there as well so this is the benefit other benefit as well yeah. All right, all right. So, uh, and uh, if, if we talk about the entire process and all that, so offer letter will be like, if, will be there in how much time period? See, after done uh, uh, interview from school side, okay, right. within the seven working days, uh, offer, uh, offer letter condition, offer letter will go into release. So after completing the telephonic interview from school side, it can be, it can, it can be telephonic, it can be Skype or anything. Okay, but once the uh, interview will go into done from school side, they will get within seven working days their offer letter. All right. So offer letter has been uh, quite fast uh, processing from yes. you, right? to be. Yes. 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 So, all right. So uh, regarding the France, it's like quite simple, easiest at the smoothest process, we can say. And the fees uh, students can easily pay. And still the fees is being although so much highly affordable, still if, if any student wants to like pay 50% of the tuition fees before the visa processing and the rest 50% before flying from India, before like arriving. Is it also been uh, possible? No, no, actually, unfortunately, uh, not possible, especially in our uh, some of the school and in some of the school, our school is also <laughs> also there. So we are only accepted full fees. <laughs> I mean, no, we don't mind, but, but uh, before flying, before flying, maybe before campus France process, okay, right. here campus France process that I will do, they need to pay their full fees payment. Whether they can do uh, in one shot payment, whether they can do in part payment, but after, after getting the full fees payment, we will go into release their uh, final offer later. And second thing here, the help, uh, the it will go into helpful uh, them for visa purpose. Okay, if they uh, paid their full fees payment, then uh, there is a higher chances to get the visa because uh, it show like they are uh, serious about their study. And uh, so that is the reason uh, we are, uh, you know, choosing only full fees payment. And most of the uh, most of the you know the institute, uh, this uh, school and everything, everyone sure. in uh, France, they are choosing only full fees payment. Right, right, right. And even though the fees are itself are <clears throat> so much highly affordable because they, they have that uh, glimpse in the mind that oh, like exactly. France is like so much exactly. expensive. But if you compare to any other country globally, the mm -hmm. MBA and any other like, uh, you know, country, they have tentative fees ranging from not not like less than 15,000, mm -hmm. 15,000 dollars. Yes. It's, it's like as simple as that half of the fees. Mm -hmm. So, right. so we, we are looking forward. Any any of the students and all the viewers to uh, have any of the queries, please let us know. You can easily reach out to us either on our call or visit to us in the mail, or we are available for you to resolve all the inquiries. So we would be happy to receive uh, like admissions and students just do not waste your time. Still, you can apply conditional basis. And if you if you have yes. all the capabilities and the documentation, you can still apply without attempting IDS on the MOI basis. Yes. So, looking forward. So uh, thank you so much. For just a uh, it's my pleasure, Tanisha. Thank you so much for again uh, to invite me. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you.